welcome back with me, Emily Goldblum, taking you through another Maison Goldblum stretch class. Um, before we get started, I want to just warm up gently our knees, our ankles, um, and also I want you to know what you're going to need. You'll need some uh, free weights, a chair, my mat, uh, water, and a good positive attitude. Um, so yes, like I mentioned, we will be doing a little bit of cardio, a cardio push in the beginning, just to get a full four, full like core body temperature. Get that up, the, get the heart rate going, um, and then we will get back into that really detailed work. Um, and that's where you'll probably need a chair for balance, um, just using a little bit of that traditional ballet technique. And uh, let's see, I think that's it. So let's just get started. We're gonna do some ankle rolls. So just roll your left ankle out. Good. And then you're gonna roll your right ankle out. Just get everything warming up before we get the music on and start our cardio. And I want you to do some ankle raises, lift those heels off the floor, up, all the way up, warming up those calves. And then let's give your calves a little stretch, stretch them out, good. Press into the calf, release the heel up, lower it down, good. And other leg, left leg back, pressing that heel down, you can get a nice little stretch in that calf, Lift the heel, lower it down, good. Then you're gonna take your right knee up, pull, release, pull, release. Use the wall if you need. Good, take the knee out to the side, good, pull up. So you're kind of hiking up that hip, bringing it back level with the other hip bone and then lift for a nice stretch. Good, lower, lift, lower. And then take it all the way down. Other leg up, left knee into chest. Lower, in, lower, in, lower. Good, now press the knee out to the side and then lower, the hip points are in line and then lift it up for a little stretch. Take it down, lift it up, whoop. keep your balance down and up and down, good, up. I also feel a nice little stretch in my low back on my right side here, good, and bring it all the way down. All right, and let's just circle those knees around. Make sure our leg joints are all warm. Other side, breathe, breathe. Good, and arms swing front, back, front, back, front, back. Hold, really anchoring that shoulder back as you press your wrist back as well. So there's that opposition happening. Good, other side. And press, pull that shoulder back. Good, take it back behind you. Lift that chin up just slightly. You'll feel that stretch happening. Lower that rib cage down. Good, and switch arms. Press and look up just ever so slightly. Look in front and then you can sort of use your head to sort of press in to that upper back of your arm. Good. Now we're gonna get started. I'm gonna put the music on. <laughs> Our top scotch jumping jacks. Up, 
side to side, and kick. That's it. And we're gonna add a punch. Punch, punch. So it's opposite arm, punches, and the other leg. Single, single, double, double, single, single, double, 
gently tap the heels in front of you. Taking the arms up. to grab your free weights and we're going to get into arms. All right, let's go. We might just grab a sip of water.
way up. In line with those ears. Press it down. And up. Good, good. Last push here with the arms. So really take your time. Hold that ribcage in place. Just the shoulders are working here. Good. Arms. Lower with control. Squeezing those shoulder blades. Pull up. Lower. Control. Good. Thigh. And you're going to reach in 
front. Give yourself a little stretch. Good. Pressing into your right leg. Trying to get a stretch left hamstring and loop. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Press in now. Lift up onto your fingertips. If you need, hold onto the chair. Not come all the way up. Good. Here on the other side, so you're ready. Now we're going to go into same thing, opposite side. So you're rock the egg and you're reaching the other leg. Front. Reach, rock the egg, swing it in front. Good. Working on your left leg, swinging, front, rock the egg. Deeper 
stretch in those glutes. Okay, now you're going to take that knee across onto your thigh. Hip point facing forward. You can bring it higher or lower. Depends on your knee and how your comfort level is. Now you're going to reach in front. Press those hips back. Good. Reach the fingertips forward. Long spine. Press down to high. And extend away. Press the sternum chest down. And away. Breathe. Take it down. Good. Come back up onto your fingertips. Put a slight bend in that support knee. You can either come all the way up on your own or use the chair. Good. And release. Now we're going to come down onto the floor. I'm going to lower the music volume. Yes, so you can hear me. That was bad. Okay, and I'm going to down. All right. Another little sip of water. And we're going to come into a wide down dog. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here we go. So I've got my hands from my mat and I've got my legs all the way behind it. Just bend and straighten those legs, lowering the heel, lifting it. Nice long lift, those hips up, press those thighs back towards the back of the room. Good. Now lower your heels as far as you go. And now I want you to press and pull with that stern chest leading, and then pull those hips up. Chest, sternum chest lead, bring those elbows down, up, tight, lead with the hips and the butt, back, pull forward. Ten. Nice body waves here, long head spine, pull the chest forward, working that core in those arms. Good. Eight. Press away, lift the hips up, pipe the booty up, lower the heels, elbows, pull, seven, pull forward, chest, and long, nice plank here, pike it up, and forward, hold, pike, add power, really engage that core to pike those hips, all the way up, good. Neutral and pipe. Take those heels down, pull it forward. Yes. Pull. Good. Drop down onto your right forearm. Take your right leg out diagonally back, and your left arm, your arm and hand. Pressing into the mat, into the floor. You're going to take that leg half circle, tap the toes to the side, and squeeze that leg back. Good. Hop. Back. Really working on those glutes, those obliques. Bring that leg forward to the side. Up. And. Eight. Tap. Back.
with your arms and inner thigh. Good, take it down. Go, go, go. And stop where it feels like a nice stretch for you. Press into it slightly with one breath. And now press away. Good, last two. Lower. Good, hold. And press up. Last one here. Lower. Good. I'm going to go all the way. Press this. I'm going to try and press my hips behind and in front. Behind. See if you can feel a different stretch in a different part of that inner thigh, hip, pelvic, girdle area. Good. And now neutral. Press up. Beautiful. You're going to come down onto your, uh, your right forearm into a plank, side plank here. Good. I'm going to reach that arm overhead and then lower and reach. Lower the hips and reach. Good. Yes. Really working those obliques. Reach overhead or just keep the hand at your hips. Good. And come back up to your down dog. Nice wide down dog. Come walk your hand all the way back. And I want you to just lower those hips all the way down. For a nice deep stretch here, deep squat. Turn those toes out slightly and just shift your body weight side to side. Just getting a little recovery here before we go back into the other side. Really open, lift, and lower, lift up. Fully engaged here and then stretch. Lift up and stretch. Good, lift those hips slightly and lower. Lovely, reach those hands in front. Turn those toes facing forward. Walk your arms in front. And coming in for our down dog body legs. Press the inner thighs back. Hips lifted up. Pull the chest forward. Contract. Chest pulls forward. Contract back. Pay attention to that core. Those ribs. The rib cage locks. Good. Pull the chest. Lead with the chest. Front chest leads back, leading with that glute, those hips, pulling you back. Up. Good. Forward. Up. Bring those hips down here. Pop them up. Good. Front. Good. And two more. Elongate that spine. Last one. Back. Beautiful. You're dropping down onto your left forearm. You're taking an extra step with that left leg back on the diagonal. And then your other hand is pressing into the floor. Half circle. Side. Who is calling me now? No. Can't talk. <laughs> All right, coming down into our half forearm plank here. And side, back, all the way side. Take it back, control. Lift and squeeze to lower with control. Half circle, back, side. Press everything up. Don't dump your weight into that shoulder joint. Lift out of it. Press up and side tap, lift it up right away. Hop. Good. Eight. Lift up, squeeze. And six, squeeze. Side back, lower, up. Side, lower, up. Good. And three. 
Now I'm gonna release the opposite arm across and reaching that back arm back. Pulling everything in and breathing. Breathe, twist, breathe. Expand that ribcage. And lift it all the way up. All right, lovely, lovely job, everyone. Well done, we did it. I am so proud of us. I'm so filled with gratitude. It's been a very full week. Um, but I couldn't ask for anything more. I'm healthy, my children are healthy, my husband's healthy, and we're all doing well. I hope you are too, and I'll see you all soon. Okay.